Duncan is special to me because I was born and raised here 78 years ago. When there's a tragedy in this town, everybody gets together. They all help each other and it's something unusual in large cities. When you come here, it's like a big family and everybody's looking out for each other. It's a close-knit community and you can really tell that everybody cares about everybody else. It's kind of fun to see everybody come together when we have uh, different community events and things at the park or when we have activities on Main Street. It is one of the friendliest, um, most open-hearted places I've ever been. We don't have a bowling alley. We don't have a theater. We don't have any of that stuff. But what we do have, we have one of the strongest, most active FFA chapters in the state of Arizona. So at Duncan Schools, the class sizes are a lot smaller than what you would find in other places, which allows the opportunity for the kids to work together a little more collaboratively and the teachers to really focus on each student's needs. And so last year, I participated in the wildlife career development event, went on a lot of trips and learned a lot of stuff about wildlife. Visitors come more specifically to see birds or other wildlife or to ride their bicycles on scenic roads or to get photographs or to go hunting. They have more specific goals in mind. But I would love to just let people know that there's so much to do here if you don't have a plan, don't have an agenda, if you just go out and open your eyes. We're surrounded by places where no one goes and they are beautiful. Business in Duncan is the best. There's lots of word of mouth here. That's what's so great about a small community. I love interacting with the local business people. I try as much as I can to give my business to locally owned businesses, of which we have a lot, but I also see there's potential that's not realized. So I would really like to see more small businesses open here, addressing not just consumer needs, but also those of the many, many people who come through who have a different set of consumer needs. There's so much growth here that is going to happen. Duncan could benefit from any business moving in here. My husband and I talk a lot about opportunities in Duncan because owning the inn that we own, we I think have a unique perspective on how many people come here, not just from all over the U.S., but from around the world because people are hungry for that experience of the Old West. And I'm not talking about a tourism experience, I'm talking about a genuine, authentic experience of what the Old West might have been like, and you get that here.